Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel KPL Learning and this is your host Kaval Barar. Today, let me take you to the world of colors and shapes and let me show you a beautiful and wonderful kit developed and designed by our academic team at KPL. We call this as Create and Learn Level 2 because there is another kit Create and Learn Level 1 that's on our website. Let me take a second here and tell you about our website which is www.kplearning.com and you must check this website after this session because you'll find amazing products on this website. Coming back to our kit Create and Learn Level 2, I am now going to show you what all we have in this kit. This is a zip pouch kit which is a very sturdy and very beautifully packed kit and this has lots of shapes and colors. The colors are purple, orange, blue, green and yellow. And the shapes are hexagon, trapezium, square, rhombus, another rhombus, a triangle and another kind of triangle. So there are seven shapes. The material that we have used is very soft and firm and it is foam based and which makes the whole kit very light. Create and Learn Level 2 which is this kit is meant for a little senior children who can handle uh, these small shapes with their tiny hands. There is, as I told you, there is another kit Create and Learn Level 1 which has big shapes and big pieces that is meant for the uh, junior children. Now, let us see what all concepts a teacher can do with this amazing kit in the class. So looking at these shapes and colors, the very first activity that comes to our mind is making patterns. So the teacher can ask the children to make random patterns or can also show the patterns and then ask the children to follow. Make an aeroplane using two squares and these two rhombuses. So the child will follow me the way I will be doing this triangle and then another square and then this trapezium. As there are so many pieces in this kit, the child can make two more aeroplanes, maybe three more aeroplanes and then you can talk about or you can, um, you know, you can ask questions on those objects. Another very beautiful feature of this kit is creating tessellation. And what is tessellation? Tessellation is creating patterns wherein there is no gap whatsoever in between the shapes or the pieces that you are using. I'm going to show you right now how we can do tessellation in the class. I'm going to take these hexagons and I'm going to put them all together in such a way that there is no gap left and there's a pattern that is formed and there is no gap in between the shapes. The shapes of this kit are designed in such a way that there is no uh, space left in between or there is no gap in between. You can check out on any two pieces. It is used in tiling, it is used uh, in carpets. The nature is full of the patterns of tessellations. Geometry forms a very important branch of mathematics, which generally is considered to be a little difficult because there's a lot of imagination involved in geometry. But with this kit, with so many shapes and colors here on the table, it is quite easy for a child to work with the kit on the table. The concept of quadrilaterals can be explained with this kit. For example, this is a quadrilateral and this is also a quadrilateral. Now the teacher can explain what is the difference between these two quadrilaterals. Why are they called quadrilaterals? What is it that makes these two different from each other? What is the meaning of trapezium? What is the meaning of square? And so on. The teacher can also talk about equilateral triangle, which is having all the sides of a triangle equal in comparison to an isosceles or a scalene triangle. So there are so many concepts of geometry, basic concepts, which uh, can be, you know, done in the class itself. As a senior maths teacher, when children come to class 9 or class 8, it is very disappointing to see that the children don't even know the basic uh, geometrical concepts. 
only when the children will be doing work on the table with these kids when the children will be doing experiential learning when the children will do, be learning by doing it will only then be possible to lay down a very strong foundation for of geometry and it will help the children in the later stages of life so i personally recommend the schools and the teachers to have such uh, tools in the class otherwise it is it becomes really very difficult for the children to just always imagine and uh, do geometry or maths in the class and now let's see how we can lay down a great foundation of mathematics by using this very amazing gift to find the total number of sides when you have these three shapes the child is going to add 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 and 14 hence the answer is 14 so you are actually making the child understand the concept of addition we all know multiplication is repeated addition right so if we take this piece and this is a hexagon how many sides are there in this uh, hexagon of course the child is going to count and say 6 so now the teacher can ask how many total number of sides are there in these four hexagons 1 2 3 4 the child is either going to add all the sides in each hexagon or can also think it like this 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6 and hence the child understands that 6 into 4 will be 24 the beauty of this kit is that we can do fractions also with this kit and how is that possible that's a hexagon and now i'm going to find out six triangles and i will fix them on this hexagon i'll just take one each place it in such a way that i'm able to complete the hexagon and now to teach fractions what we can do is we can say is this triangle is one one two three four five six one sixth of the hexagon two triangles will make two sixth of the hexagon and three triangles will make three sixth of the hexagon this is how we can lay down the foundation of fractions we can also do addition and subtraction of fractions so this becomes an amazing tool to lay down the foundation of very difficult concepts of mathematics now i'm going to show you a beautiful activity which is an amazing feature of this kit and that is i am going to take a bowl of plain water this is a bowl of plain water and any plain surface let me take my laptop and show you some interesting thing. I am going to dip a few pieces of this kit in, in this water and just randomly I am picking up a few pieces, dipping them in water and now I will completely immerse these pieces in water and now I am going to take one piece out and place it on the laptop. Can you see? This gets stuck on the laptop, it is not falling down. And this amazing feature of this kit makes it so interesting for the children and the teachers to do activities in the class. And now if I have to uh, make a pattern out of it, I can just show this. And And it's not falling. I think the teachers can use this feature in the class to show them uh, and so that the children can follow the steps. For example, let's say we were talking about fractions. So the teacher can explain fractions like this, dipping it in water, and then she can dip a triangle like this, put it here like this, another one on this side a third one like this isn't it a wonderful activity i feel 
with this activity the children are going to enjoy your class and i'm sure the children are going to love you for this kit With this, I would like to wrap up today's session. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have liked my session, please consider subscribing to our channel because I would be uploading many more sessions like these from the kits that are uh, on our website. And don't forget to push the notification bell because you will be then getting the notification as soon as I'll be uploading videos. Thank you so much for watching once again. Stay tuned.